Well, what's up my dudes, it's Ossifer, and today we have a huge variety of Scarlet and Violet packs to check out today to find out what you should be spending your money on and what's gonna give you the best chances of getting a solid hit. The first product we'll be looking at is the Booster Bundle. These come with six packs. That's gonna be the theme of the video, six packs. So we'll also have six sleeve packs. So making sure everything is fair and even. And last but not least, we'll have the three pack blisters as well to check out, which we have two of them, which you guessed it, comes out to six packs. And I want you guys to comment down below, what's your go-to product when you go shopping for Pokemon cards? Do you like to buy sleeves? Do you like to buy ETBs? Do you like to buy booster bundles, building battles, or the three pack blisters, single pack blisters? Let me know down below and make sure you do comment this time around because in this video, I will be picking one lucky winner to win the promos of the three pack blisters. So that's this Arcanine promo with the Cosmo foil and the Dondozo promo with the Cosmo foil as well as the code cards that come with it. I know it's not a crazy giveaway prize, but I figured we'd try to do some giveaways on this channel now and I'll pick a winner next video. It'll be announced next video, so make sure you like and subscribe. Tune into next week's video and see if you won. Now before we get started into opening the packs, make sure you also check out in the description below the link to deckoutgaming.ca and use discount code Aussie to get 5% off your order. If you like any of the products we're checking out today, you can find them at deckoutgaming.ca. So the first one we're checking out, like I said, will be the booster bundle. Every booster bundle does come with six boosters and the deck box itself. Well, not really a deck box, but you could use it as a deck box. It's pretty durable, not bad. I like to keep every single one I have. They come in handy for card storage. So first pack magic for the booster bundle. Let's find out which product is gonna give us the most bangers. Hopefully some double cheeseburgers. Starting off with that heat. Looks like we got ourselves a little greed in action. The Crocodile, Flamigo, Squawkabilly in our first reverse slot, Pokemon Catcher, and Professor's Research. No first pack magic. I haven't had too much luck with booster bundles. However, it seems to be the quite opposite, or quite the opposite for everybody else. When they open booster bundles, they're at least walking away with something they're really happy about. So let's see, we do have six stabs at this. So let's see if the second pack magic can give us something crazy. Two reverses that are both grass type and the Coridon Hollow. Pretty cool. I used to be happy about that Coridon Hollow and the Maridon Hollow. And then I found out, turns out you can get a lot of them. And I think you can hear my dog scratching himself in the background. That's our boy Sky. We love Sky. He's such a good boy. Halfway through this now with a third pack. Can we get our first hit? Still nothing, but we got that Skeledurge. One day I will play the Scarlet and Violet games and I'm gonna pick Quay Coco as my starter and I'm gonna have eventually a Skeledurge. I've been talking about it in so many videos now, I'm still working my way through Pokemon Legends Arceus. And I know some of you go, oh my goodness, did he just say Legends Arceus? Reverse, reverse, and Annihilate. And yes, I did. I know a lot of people say Legends Arceus. I say Arceus, and I even Googled it. Turns out both ways are actually canon. And you're like, how is that possible? Because in one, I forget if it was like in the anime, they said Arceus, but then like, in a movie, they said Arceus. So like, oh, let's go. The Gardevoir EX. That's like, that was one of my biggest chase cards. I got a friend. In fact, he's right there in chat. Corpse Senior is after this card and I was willing to trade him this card for his Maridon SIR if I didn't pull the Maridon myself. That's huge. Looks like that booster bundle is giving, his, giving themselves a huge lead. Not a double cheeseburger, but that Gardevoir EX is so good. That is one of the biggest chases for everyone in Scarlet and Violet. So glad I just hit it. That's actually huge, man. That was one of the cards I really wanted. And remember when I was saying these booster bundles hadn't treated me well, but most people usually get one big hit they really like? We just manifested it. They were right. We do get one hit we really do like, and it was the Gardevoir EX. And ending it off with just the one hit 
but that was a really good hit. So let's bring it over to now our six boosters, sleeved boosters, and see if they can keep up with that Gardevoir EX. So first pack magic with the sleeves. I know I asked you guys what your favorite product is to buy. For me personally, I like to get an ETB, at least one ETB of every set. And then sometimes I get sad when they do sets like Scarlet and Violet where they have two versions of the ETB because now I have to spend twice as much money because I feel like I'm a completionist and I need one every one of every product. But I'll always buy at least one ETB. And then once I have that, this is the first pack, by the way, for the sleeves. And once I have an ETB, I will branch out. I'll most likely get some sleeves if I ever just want to treat myself. The build, build in, uh, sorry, the build in battles. We'll get to that one eventually. But the booster bundles are actually a pretty good deal if you find a place that's selling them like for a pre pretty decent value because your price per pack there is going to be a lot better than just buying single sleeves. So if you can find those, I guess that's really good. Uh, the three pack blisters I enjoy too if I don't already have the promos on them. So I do prioritize three pack blisters just to get at least one copy of said promos that come with it. So, so far, two sleeve boosters in. Nothing crazy, but that's just how the booster bundle started. Nothing crazy until we were on that latter half. Got ourselves that Gardevoir EX. Let's see if we can get something of similar value. My other chase right now really is the Maridon SIR. I've opened quite a few Scarlet and Violet packs for myself, and I don't plan on master setting the set. I did just want to get my own personal chases for it, and I have most of them. I think the Maridon SIR is what I need left, and probably the Gold Maridon. Normally, I wouldn't have wanted the Gold Maridon. The only reason why I want it this time is because on one of my personal pack openings, just, you know, Outside of the YouTube and the Twitch space, I did get a gold Coridon, and it just doesn't feel right to have a gold Coridon without having the gold Maridon to match, which is why I want the Maridon SIR. Because you guessed it, I already have the Coridon SIR for myself. So I just like having things completed. You know, if they have pairs, I like to have them in pairs. Looks like we just have the cloth hollow here. So, so far, no hits out of the sleeves. The sleeves a lot of people like because you can't weigh them. So you can't weigh the sleeves. They don't come from booster boxes that have, you know, you know, like somewhat of a guessable hit rate. Uh, so sleeves are just really independent. You know, you, you never know what you're going to get out of a single sleeve. Nobody ever knows. So they that's what they usually get. They feel like it's, it gives them the best chance at getting something good so far. It's not giving us anything. We are on the last sleeve pack without anything outside of the guaranteed hollow. Can we get some last pack magic here? This is the last one. The booster bundle at least gave us one hit. One of the best hits we can get. Can this booster bundle, nope. Can this sleeved booster manifest on that last pack magic? We got the Muck, Vivalon, Toxel, Palpad, A Team Star Grunt. This is actually one of my chase cards too. No way. I know this isn't a special card. It's not one of the valuable ones, but I just like how these two guys look. No, I totally forgot I was chasing this card too. Super happy about it. That's two chase cards of mine knocked out in one video. Now, off the top of my head, the only one left is the Maridon SIR. Can we get it in these? two packs of triple boosters. If you haven't already, don't forget to comment down below answering the comment question we asked at the start of the video because I will be picking a winner, a random winner out of the, out of the people who commented and you will be receiving these two promo cards from the three pack blisters as well as the code cards to, that come with it. I will ship it out to you for free. So make sure you participate by commenting down below, answering our comment question that I asked at the start of the video. And let's see if we can get some first pack magic with the three pack blisters. The winners for those promos will be announced next video. So make sure to like and subscribe. So you will be here for next week's video on Monday to find out if you won. Reverse, reverse a Arcanine EX. All right, nothing crazy. But the three pack blisters already with the one hit. So far, we only got one hit per product so far. Booster bundle only gave us one hit. The six sleeve boosters only gave us one hit. Now the three pack blisters, 
one hit already. It would be quite a shame if we went the remaining five packs of these blisters with just the one hit, but I find that highly unlikely. I don't know. Something inside me just tells me that's not going to be the case. We got the reverse, reverse, and the King Gambit. Oh boy. I hope I'm not wrong. I hope I didn't jinx myself. We are after that Miranda on SIR, man. I got two of my chase cards so far in one video. Can we bless Aussie with his last chase card and make him the happiest Poketuber on the YouTubes? We got the Shuppet, Sprigatito, Houndour, Drifloon Balloon, Ultra Ball Ball, Espathra Bird, Arvin, Husbondo, Reverse, Reverse, and the Indeedee, okay. So this is the third booster. I didn't keep track of which booster came from which blist three pack blister. But no matter the case, this would be the last pack from one of them. So we can somewhat keep track of the hit rate per three pack blister. If this ends up being a dud pack, we end up having one hit in that blister and we'll see if the other blister does the same. Oh, let's go the Karelia. No way. We've got two thirds out of the storyline Rolls Krillia Gardevoir line now. Oh my goodness. Now I kind of don't want to trade away that Gardevoir. I'm one Ralts away from completing the set. Oh my goodness. I really didn't want to pull that because I'm such a completionist for sets. Now that I pulled it, I only need one more card. I just need the Ralts. Now I might have to keep these for myself. Corpse, I'm so sorry. Oh my goodness, this is the second to last pack out of the blisters. There's no way we just hit the Guard of War and the Karelia in the same video. Now with two packs left, I'm asking for two things. Maridon SIR or that Ralts Illustration Rare. Please, Pokemon. Please, is this the reverse? No. Please, can you make it happen? Reverse, reverse, and the Jacques. Okay, these three pack blisters are popping off. Three hits so far in five boosters with the three pack blisters. That's just telling you guys to make sure you comment below and win these three pack booster promos because the three pack blisters, I I'm, I don't even know what I'm saying. She sells seashells by the seashore. Dude, these three pack blisters are insane right now. This is the last pack. Last pack of the whole video too. Can we get the Ralts? Can we get the on SIR? Oh, just the reverse and the hairy crab cloth. Dude, that was crazy. That was a roller coaster of emotions. Just to recap real quick, from the booster bundle, we walked away with the biggest hit of the video, the Gardevoir EX. I think if we were to do some kind of competition between the three products, I would probably still label the booster bundle as the winner, just because it gave us the biggest hit. Uh, and then, the blisters, sadly, definitely a hit or miss with the blisters. You never know what you're gonna get. We only got one hit out of the six sleeve boosters. I keep using blisters and boosters interchangeably. I'm sorry, my brain's all over the place. But another quote unquote winner would be the three pack blisters because we got three hits, 50% hit rate between the two blisters. And I think if you're counting, if you're going for quality over quantity, I mean, if you're going for quantity over quality, the three pack blisters were the big dub. So those were our hits. We got five hits and 18 packs overall. So that's not bad. You guys make sure to like and subscribe. Comment down below if you haven't already. Make sure to participate in this giveaway. The winner will be announced next week. So make sure to hit that subscribe button. Watch us next week. Click right here to watch a previous video of ours. And I'll see you guys next week. Thank you. Bye.